Hello, this is Jacob from Khan Audio. Today, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to do the VF heated seat system update and the CAN bus update as well. So first of all, what you want to do is obviously follow the download process that we have standard with every single update, meaning you want to find a USB up to eight gigabytes, make sure that you format the USB FAT32 um, and then download the files. Uh, so the CAN bus files or the system update files um, onto the USB and you want to make sure you don't have those files in the same folder they're sitting in you want to make sure they're exposed on the USB um, and I'll show you what I mean by that in a moment so this is the system update we're going to be doing first I'm going to plug the system update in I've downloaded the correct files onto this USB now from here I'm going to wait for the little USB icon to appear at the top of the screen right there once that appears I'm going to tap the home icon uh, I'm just going to show you guys how uh, the files should be downloaded first. So, because this unit's like a computer, it has a file manager to access the files and folders. So from here, what I want you to do is tap that, tap USB disk, and make sure the files are sitting exposed just like that. They're not in any folders like this, but they're sitting outside of the um, folder just like that these files just there and once you have confirmed that that they aren't in a folder you can tap the home icon tap settings tap car settings down the bottom by scrolling down and once you tap car settings simply tap the system update option down here once you tap system update you just want to tap usb zero once you do that it will go through the boot up process and do the update for you um so simple as tap that and there you go it'll run you through the process reset the unit on its own now i'm going to cancel that quickly so go back home there we go so i'm just going to wipe that away so i can show you guys how to do the can bus update now that is how you do the system update once the update's done it's going to reset then you want to grab your canvas update same situation with this you want to make sure the files are exposed um with the canvas update we've also included an apk for the canvas update installer so what you want to do first of all plug in your usb confirm the icon pops up again tap the home icon then we're going to hop into file manager again this is if you don't have the blue can update application to do this canvas update now we're going to tap the usb disk zero which is the usb connected and right at the bottom you'll see that we have the can bar can box update apk so what we do is we're going to download that first this is for the vf so you want to make sure you get the right canvas installer um yep yeah, that is installed once that's installed we just tap done we're going to go home now this unit is a display unit we sadly don't have this connected to a car and the only way a can bus activates is when it's connected to a vehicle so we can get a hold of the air conditioning controls steering wheel controls and all other controls of the car itself now because it's not in a car i can't show you guys the update actually functioning because we don't have a can bus connected behind this but once you have the usb and can bus connected and you've downloaded the application all you simply need to do is tap can update and this will go into this mode then give your percentage sign going from zero to a hundred percent and once it's it's hundred it's just going to exit you out of the application once you exit it out of the application simply swipe down and then tap reset for me then tap ok and this will register all the updates and reconfigure it um, but yes that is the entire process for the vf heated seats and the uh, system update that we have available please follow this step by step if you have any further questions or issues Contact us on our website's live chat support team or call us at 1300 696 488. Thank you for watching. Have a lovely day and stay safe.